Let's look at reducing mixed numbers today. When you have a whole number in a fraction, you have a mixed number. When you have a mixed number with a fraction, you need to make sure that the fraction is lowest terms. So looking at this fraction, I know that 7 ninths is in lowest terms, and I do not need to reduce it. This fraction is a mixed number as well. 21 27 is going to be the fractional part, and 5 is the whole number part. I need to reduce, though, the fraction part. So I need to think in my mind what goes into 21 and into 27. I can start by listing the different factors of 21 and 27. 1 times 21 equals 21. 3 times 7 equals 21. And that's it. Do the same thing for 27. 1 times 27. 3 times 9. And that's it. Now I'm going to look for the one that they have in common. And you can see that 3 is what they have in common. I divide 21 by 3 and I get 7, and then I divide 27 by 3 and I get 9. So my new fractional piece is going to be 7 ninths. Don't forget your whole number though. Your full answer is going to be 5 and 7 ninths. Sometimes you're given a mixed number that also has an improper fraction. Remember, an improper fraction is a number that the numerator is higher than the denominator. So 5 and 22 thirds has an improper fraction even though it's a mixed number. I need to make my improper fraction into a mixed number and then add the whole number 5 to that. I can do this by dividing 22 by 3. And I know that 3 goes into 22 7 times. And I know that there's going to be a remainder of 1. So my mixed number with the improper fraction of 22 thirds is going to be 7 and 1 third. You can see that I got the 7 from the answer here. I got the 1 from the remainder. And I got the 3 from the divisor. Now I also need to add the 5, which is the whole number, to this number in order to have a final answer. I know that 7 plus 5, since I'm adding it to the whole number, is going to be 12, and the fractional part stays the same. Your answer in all is going to be 12 and 1 third. Again, this is a mixed number, but the fractional part is an improper fraction, so I need to reduce it and I need to change it into a mixed number. So the first thing that I'm going to do is take 9 divided by 2. And I know 9 divided by 2 is going to be 4, and there's going to be a remainder of 1. So my new number for 9 halves is going to be 4 and 1 half. I got the 4 from when I divided. The remainder is 1, and the half comes from the 2, the divisor. So now I need to take 4 and 1 half, which is going to represent 9 halves, and I need to combine it with the 2 that's left over. So I know that 2 plus 4 is 6, and since there's no fractional piece to add, I know it's 6 and 1 half. 